What's up guys, Stu Mike here from Mike Force One and today I'll be starting a new Let's Play with the Modern Warfare mod for Hearts Fine 3. Now um I'll be starting from Y2K and playing as Brazil. So this will be about 150 years after my Victoria one. Um this this mod was is pretty good. Um I was just testing it because it's slightly different to the way I'm used to playing it. Um but yeah, we're gonna go to Brazil. We're gonna hopefully reunite it. Um, reunite South America under Brazilian control. <laughs> kind of mirror what I'm attempting to do in um, my Brazilian uh, Victoria 2 Let's Play. Uh, so yeah, this is this has modern countries. Um, Germany, boom, France, <laughs> UK, uh, the mightiest of them all, New Zealand. So yeah, I'll be staying from Y2K, so I was in about three, nearly four. So, let's start. Ooh, there we are, 9-11. Wonder how big the event's gonna be for that. Probably change the whole gameplay. Ah, the music in this game is like, military, uh, comms chatter. Uh, it's kinda, oh my shit. <laughs> yeah, so uh, this is something that you guys may notice. <laughs> the fucking, Provinces are huge. I mean, look at them. Look at the size of these. <laughs> so yeah, it's um all completely changed. Uh, so we have diplomacy. Boom. Uh, NATO. All right. Let's just scan. Uh, first thing to do in this game is scan. Make sure no one's a part of the um NATO. Let's see. Nope. Right. So with that, I can build up my army. Now I go to divisions. Template one, congratulations, you guys are going to be my new armored template. Now um technology is pretty weak in this, uh so yeah, it's um the interface obviously needs developing. Uh I was looking at the mod D B page for this and the creator of this is Israeli. And so with the Israeli Palestinian conflict that's happening right now, he's unable to um, release beta 5 for this, which obviously we <laughs> we can't really do anything about I mean, good on for serving this country, even though it's a controversial war um, yeah, so improvised armor, yes please AI technology right, so something that you guys may have noticed about the Black Ice mod for this is the AI control is pretty shit um, in terms of helping with technology. So, first thing we need to do, as always, is infantry. Gas mask, okay. Okay, okay. Uh, yeah, the interface of this is kind of weird, but... Phew. Oh, well, what are you going to do about it? Uh, Clever warfare, sure. Sure. Right. Now if we go production. Um... It appears that the <laughs> artillery just doesn't exist. Does, ah, just doesn't exist in this, which is eh, it's fine. So I will have two infantry brigades supported by two armored brigades. That way, I should be able to smash through the foolish, foolish Argentinian reserve lines. Well, assuming that Argentina is ah Argentina, Argentina is the first one that I won't go for. So, I probably won't need to go for Argentina first. I will instead go for uh, Guinea or France. <laughs> no, not France. Uh, Suriname. Uh, hopefully, I'm pronouncing them correctly. Uh, air wing. Right, come on, guys. We need, we need a good air force. We can easily smash them. Right, so we'll get a lot of strategic bombers. So we can bomb them into submission. Start production. Until there. A navy. No. No need. Production. Technology. Politics. AI control. Intelligence. <laughs> why am I why am I spying in North Korea? Anyways. AI control. Here we have our Louis. Equals. Yeah. There is no general. So yeah, this is currently a beta, so it's not exactly the most polished off mod, but still good. Still good. Now we've wait. We can see what's up. Oh, okay. Pierce that 
my industry is even better. When I was doing a test for this, I was um, playing as New Zealand, so probably one not too good with, as far as Brazil's concerned. Interceptor, yes please. Division air wing, heavy fighter. Right, I just kind of, oh, there we are. 2010 is due to be finished. Oh. The research office appears to not let me upgrade um, my industry. Oh no, yeah, again. God, stupid. Oh no, it looks like the AI is actually doing it. Sweet. <laughs> I can do with that, you know. On artillery, sure. 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 Of course, the only problem with this is. Every country that's non-NATO is very far behind technology and have zero military, so it's it's kind of a bit of a pain, but you know, what are you going to do? Diplomacy, I will just AI controls that bad boy. Australia's drifting towards NATO. Yeah, so you can play from the Syrian Civil War, so it's pretty modern. Um, let's bring it out. Yeah, currently my mighty army is about 500, <laughs> firmly, uh, production. Yeah, that's saying that's a bit of a pain in the ass. is that, like, yeah, <laughs> it's, it's real pain. Uh, it's how backwards my thing is. Oh, technology. Okay, probably didn't help that I went straight for the tank units. In fact, template 2, congratulations, you guys are now infantry. So yeah, as <laughs> as I said, it's a little bit more unpolished than the original Hearts of Iron, but what are you going to do about it, you know? <laughs> Just adapt. Here we are. AI control that bad boy. Now wait. A few months and it appears that Paraguay actually does have an army. So I am going to no neutrality myself and smack Paraguay. <laughs> smack them a little bit. Oh, Uruguay. Uruguay looks suspiciously similar to Argentina with the colours. So it's kind of half of me spot. But not to worry, not to worry. Come June 26th, I will be prepared. Ha ha ha. Some serious, serious war. Um, on artillery. That does give you artillery, I believe. Pretty sure it does. Yeah, when I was in New Zealand, I was just getting like a feel for the gameplay. I didn't do too much research. So, yeah, that could possibly screw me up a little bit. Oh well. Not to worry. Not to worry. Still gonna smack them. Now, if we wait. Till June 26. Yeah, so um, if I say, for example, played as a European nation, I would already have a standing army. But obviously, we do not want that. We want to play as a South American nation. So what I'll probably do is just pause it here and appear when I have a reasonably stronger army. And I'm back, guys. Um, what I've done in the meantime is I have one infantry unit. But what has changed is unlock the technology to research. Mo uh, motorized brigades so that means that they can move faster than the four kilometers per hour that yeah these guys can move in so it appears that I can actually declare war on Uruguay just save it here actually Brazil invades is that Uruguay or Paraguay Uruguay yeah I'm not too fast about the spelling uh right so, without further ado, we declare war. Conquer. Damn straight I want conquer. And we we get to the capital. Alright, let's do this. Because I, if I am aware correctly, they do not have an army to combat me. So, that could be good. <laughs> it means that I can very quickly get all this 
get all this territory that I need. So, that's it, boys. Keep marching. Buy the industry advance, okay? Thank okay. you. Yeah, all well, South America's beginning to fear me. Just how quickly I can march into their land. Just look at me. Look, just, just doing my thing. Just, you know, doing my thing. Yes, please. First army, first corps, third infantry division. You can head up to that guy. Hello. Two love infrastructure, eh? Eh, hey, well. Okay, it appears they can't actually invade them. Alright. Okay. Oh well. Uh, you can just face. I, know, I feel like I need to expand quicker. We can face. Ah, uh, let's see. France, Suriname. Oh, let's do. Appears that all these places here are too low of infrastructure, so I'll just keep my boys there. Actually, you, you might as well just prepare for the invasion of Argentina. Hey, Argentina has allowed my army. Sweet. So, that's gonna fall very quickly. Like this conscription law. Yes, yes, please. Right, full organization. Okay. Screw you, Argentina, then. That's right. That's right. That's a keep. Oh, yay. <laughs> Yay, I conquered. Conquer all. Alright, you hit there. You hit there as well. Oh, that that kind of fell. <laughs> fell very quickly. Uh, countries mobilized in peacetime. Get rid of that mobilization. I don't need it. Alright, intelligence, whatever. Where is it? Technology. Right, so the technology, it's... Because it's in beta, I guess, it's pretty... You can't go further than one, I believe. Like that there. I've already maxed out that cannon. Um, escorts. Right, what do I just upgrade? Upgrade secret. Here we are laser weapons. Ooh, I feel the wrath of my flashlight. My laser light. Ooh, paratroopers. Yes, please. Alright, that, that did some solid indicting into there. So. No, I just kind of wait. Australia has been accepted into NATO, eh? Filthy, filthy Australians. They don't need to be accepted into NATO. Right. Just gonna risk it for a biscuit. Get Argentina ASAP. Alright. First core. Yeah, you guys. Move your asses over there. First army. You guys can go here. So I can just keep a wee supply line happening between my boys. Education advance. Okay. Yay. Riveting. Uh, armor. Yeah, so this, uh, this game obviously needs a hell of a lot more uh, to it. But it looks like I can quickly expand. Probably in this episode. Just and take South America very quickly. Alright, that's it. My navy definitely needs some more strategic kind of planning, but but I'll get there eventually. Right, yep, sure. Can't believe I didn't even have gas masks. That was, that's pretty foolish of me. Alright, capital. Okay, it's good. It's good. Alright, appears to be going good. Now onwards. I need a draft. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, some small ships. The battle. <laughs> Yay! Technology. Uh, small ships. Escorts, there we are. And down we go. Research all those. So, yeah, the research goes by pretty quick. Tactical maps, yay. White industry, yay. De oh my god, why is that five? Like, why they get cut back so much? Oh well. Still, I suppose I can still attack two. Yay! <laughs> that, was, that was too damn easy. It's way too easy. Right. Chile! You shoot me. 
Perhaps I spoke too soon. Um, are you kidding me? Give me two life infrastructure. What do you mean? What do you mean? You fools. No. Oh, bugger. Right, 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 right. Let's, uh, let's see, where can I attack? Apparently I can attack Bolivia. Right, go on boys. March out to Bolivia. I, I can't. Hmm. That appears to have dampened my uh, my spirit. Right, so if there's orange, I can march to. So <laughs> kind of contained in my army. Right, so um, this is a look at it. I guess. Um, come in if you think we can. If I should keep playing it, because right now it's it's good, but it needs obviously beta five. Um, look at the mod DB comments. The developer before this Palestinian Israeli um, mess started actually said that in beta five he's going to allow pretty much all these other countries to have armies, so you're not just focused on Europe. So just um just comment if you want to try Brazil, keep going as Brazil, or if you want me to go as Europe, I mean, most likely I would go as Germany, because, you know, it's Germany, <laughs> who doesn't like the modern Germany, so, yes, do Mike here for Mike Force One, saying thank you for watching, like, comment, subscribe, and become a Mike today, and I'll see you in another episode of this series, or maybe another, thank you, and goodbye.